Alright, how's it going all you guys and girls in the Illumination time to jump aboard the Loom Train? It's me, it's me, it's JJD, JJ, Double J, the Illuminator here, the sweet one. Also known by almost countless other aliases and nicknames, but we're not going to get into that right now. Today I want to talk about hindsight. It's just something I've uh, been thinking about today. They say hindsight is always twenty twenty. You know, once you see what the possibilities were, you can make a much better uh, decision. You know, some people call it a Monday morning quarterback because of all the football games that happen on a Sunday. But um, it's funny how we don't obviously have all the answers when we're making choices, whether it's average everyday choices or if it's life-changing choices or whatever. But um, having regrets is definitely something that uh, becomes harder to live with, I believe anyway, for me. It becomes harder to live with um, the older I get because I look back at more time that's passed as the years go on that I should have did this and should have did that. But at the time, you don't have that luxury of being able to look back. You just make the best choice you can at that given moment. But even something as simple as, you know, I used to live in a, I mean, it was a smaller town at the time. Um, didn't live there long, but in, um, I could just remember not taking advantage of walking places that were within walking distance. Not as much as I should have anyway. Um, during this whole pandemic, you know, you, you tend to look back at stuff that we took for granted that maybe isn't as available anymore, or it, it's around here anyway. You know, things like the neighborhood barbershop, you know, when I was a kid, being able to, to go there or even as a teenager or a young adult in my 20s, or just being able to walk to a barber shop to get a haircut or, you know, stuff like that, that right now is a little bit harder to do. There's so many more, there's so many more rules and, and laws in place right now that it's like you don't know how good you had it when all of a sudden some of these liberties are are gone or, or at least... They're, they're changed to the point where just going out and, and getting a, a meal, a sit-down meal at a restaurant is not the same thing anymore. Um, a lot of restaurants around here um, haven't opened back up. And there's a percentage, which I don't know off the top of my head, but there's a percentage, I think around here they said there was 16% of the restaurants around here are closed for good. The smaller mom-and-pop restaurants that that couldn't make it they didn't have home delivery or d chose not to and 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 what you know what have you it's just so many different things that we took for granted that i find myself looking back on you know especially when i had the energy to do it if you go back you know 20 years where i said i should have did this just i'm not even talking about traveling or, or any big decision i'm talking about smaller decisions like you know taking a walk to the post office or taking a walk to the bakery and 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 getting a you know getting some fresh bread or something just it, it's just a little bit different now that's all i mean what do you guys and girls think i hope you're staying safe i love you all take care this is the illuminator and i'll be back <laughs>